Guys, let's see what happens if we jump into the train. What better way to celebrate the release of the third Splatoon by showing you the most broken glitch in the first game where you get to explore the whole Inkopolis, basically. So you get to see these little secrets that the game didn't want you to see. So uh, I'm going to show you how to do it, guys. First things first, you just got to spawn in. Here's like the main main area, the main lobby, Inkopolis. I know, nostalgia, guys, so much nostalgia. So what you got to do is go over here, see these two dudes. Sometimes they don't spawn all the time, so you have to like go back to like the customization or something so what you gotta do see this Karen dude jump like turn into a squid it takes a long time it's, it's a little tricky guys it might take you a fat minute to perform this glitch correctly but what this is gonna let you do is let you explore the outer sections of Inkopolis and get to see what's beyond the wall there it is guys there it is so now you slowly want to walk through because if you go too far, you're going to glitch through the bottom, through the floor basically. But we glitched through the wall. It only took me about maybe 50 tries. Let's explore. First things first. That voice cracked though. First things first. First things first. First things first. Let me show you what was behind the amiibo box. You guys want to know what's behind the amiibo box? Is there something behind this amiibo box? Do they actually put attention to detail in this game for something that you can't actually purposely see well it turns out they actually put the real amiibo illustration at the back of the box it's kind of cool to think that they put so much attention to detail for something that you're not supposed to see so shout outs to nintendo for that that is pretty dope pretty dope but uh yeah let's uh, let's explore the outer sections of this map let's let's go let's go to uh so first things first, you can't really see, you weren't supposed to see the train station. But if you ju I'll, sh I'll jump into the train at the end of this video, I'll show you what happens. Oh, let's just go to, let's go to like the, but like look at this guys. You weren't just supposed to see what's beyond the wall. You can see literally what's beyond the wall. It's like a little town stuff. Yo, is this Platoon 3 city over here or something or what? So that's pretty cool. They got like writing and stuff. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. I'm sure that doesn't mean anything, but... You think that's uh, Splatoon 3 area over there? Question mark? I don't know. But yeah, there's so many little secrets and stuff that you weren't supposed to... See, you guys can actually see the train going through now. That's pretty dope. Pretty dope. So, what's over here? Guys, we're in the shoe store. And if I go a little bit too much farther, then we're actually going to like... It's going to warp us inside the shoe store. So, this is about as far as we can go. Look, we can jump. We are physically in the shoe store. Yes, sir. Let's go check out the other stores. Yo, what's over here? We got the clothing over there. You can actually see like the back of the clothing store. Here we are. We're we're inside, guys. This we're inside the clothing store without actually being, you know, we can actually move around, guys, in the clothing store, kind of, without actually being in the clothing store area. Look at that. Look at these amazing 2D pictures. Except the hat does. Hat's uh, 3D. Haha, <laughs> we're inside and you're not get wrecked. And then we got the actual weapons. Can you actually go in the... Let's see what happens if you go inside. Look at that. Guys, we're in the weapon store without technically being in the weapon store. Guys, I guess I'm the boss now. Screw Sheldon. I am the new boss. It's funny because they didn't want you to like see like these things up close so this is actually just 2d little uh drawings besides this besides this weapon right here which is pretty cool what else any other stores let's see what happens if you go over here so this is where this is the place where the lobby can you actually go in the lobby there it is guys there's a the lobby literally right over here The nostalgia music. I don't want to go too aggressive though, because you can fall through. Like that. Rip. There it is, guys. There it is. Let's go. So we explored this section. Let's go explore this section over here. Like I showed you guys. 
they have the amiibo drawing that you can actually see. Let's go over here. I know if you go more so to this grass area, you're probably going to fall through the, the invisible, you know, floor. So look at these. Look at this stuff. You weren't supposed to actually see these things. You got like what? Posters and stuff. Like I don't even know what that means, but that's pretty cool. All this stuff. We got like spray paint, little graffiti. Is that an Octoling little graffiti over there? Question mark. So, let's see. Look at this, guys. You can actually see what's behind the creepy dude. You can actually see his back. What is this, guys? What timeline do we live in? But, uh, yeah. That's basically as much as you can see from over there. Can you walk around over here? Yep. Nope. You fall back into death. And finally, guys, let's just see what's going to happen if we jump into the train. Will it, like, bounce us off? Will it actually, like, run us over and die? Let's find out. I was always curious, what happens if, you know, the train hits you? Or does it actually hit you? Or does it go through you? We'll find out. Train, I'm coming for you. There it is. Yes, sir. So, I'm surprised I never patched this glitch at all. Like, it's still here. Okay. There's a train, guys. Guys, let's see what happens if we jump into the train. We fall to our death. Rest in peace. Well, uh, that's about it for uh, this video, guys. I thought about this glitch before Splatoon 3 releases. Because, you know, you get, to, you get to explore the new hub in Splatoon 3 before the new Splatfest demo. So that's pretty dope. But yeah, remember this guy? Will this dude make a return in Splatoon 3? Question mark. The OG. But yeah, thank you all for watching. I really appreciate all the new, the likes, comments, subs. And uh, I guess I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Stay tuned for more videos, especially Strikers and perhaps Splatoon 3? Question mark. Toodaloo, motherfuckers.